Let's ultrasound! On today's edition, we're back in the ultrasound nobology gallery, and we're talking about the difference between read zoom and write zoom. Before we can dive into talking about Zoom, it's really crucial to understand pre-processing versus post-processing on an ultrasound machine. Pre-processing on an ultrasound machine is processing of echo information before it is stored in the system memory. And this occurs while the image is live. Anytime you manipulate an ultrasound control before the image is frozen, this is known as pre-processing. It's important to note that all ultrasound controls are pre-processing controls. Post-processing is the opposite. This is processing of echo information after it is stored in the system memory, and this occurs while the image is frozen. So anytime you freeze an image and then manipulate an ultrasound control, you're using a post-processing function. Only a handful of ultrasound controls are post-processing controls, meaning that you can use them once the ultrasound image is frozen. And some of these are TGC, gain, zoom, and measurement calipers. Other ultrasound controls, such as Doppler, depth, frequency, focal zones, must be used only when the image is live. It's also important to note that some ultrasound machines do not have post-processing capabilities, and the ultrasound controls can only be manipulated while the image is live. Now let's talk about the ultrasound zoom control. This is magnification of an ultrasound image, and there's two types of zoom controls on an ultrasound machine. Read zoom, which is known as a frozen type of zoom, and write zoom, which is live zoom. Not all ultrasound machines have both types. It's dependent upon whether that machine has post-processing functions or not. When both types of zoom are available, they are accessed by a solitary button or knob on the ultrasound machine known as the zoom control. And the type of zoom that is being used is dependent upon whether the image is live or frozen. First, let's cover read zoom. Read zoom is a post-processing type of zoom, and this occurs while the image is frozen. The ultrasound machine reads and magnifies the existing pixel data, and this results in a loss of image resolution as the image is magnified. To use read zoom, you freeze the ultrasound image and then twist the zoom ultrasound knob. The next question I commonly am asked is how should you optimize read zoom? Read zoom is primarily used when a difficult to capture area, such as when imaging a moving child or fetus or another moving target like the heart, needs to be magnified. While using read zoom, be really conscious of the fact that the image will quickly become blurry as it is magnified. It's always preferable to use write zoom when possible to have less image degradation or blurriness as the image is magnified. So if you need to use read zoom due to a challenging area to capture that needs to be zoomed, you're going to want to use less of a magnification level to ensure that your image is not becoming blurry. The second type of zoom is write zoom, and this is a pre-processing type of zoom. All ultrasound machines will have write zoom, where many ultrasound machines may not have post-processing functions and may not have read zoom. Write zoom occurs while the image is live, and as the magnification occurs, the ultrasound machine is rewriting the existing pixel data. And this results in less degradation of the image resolution as the image is magnified. To use write zoom, you twist the zoom knob while the image is live, magnifying the image as you are live. So how should you optimize write zoom? You wanna focus on zooming the area of interest to make it the star of the show, but not zooming it so much that it becomes blurry. Note that in many cases, the depth control alone without zoom can make an area of interest the star of the image without having to resort to using the zoom control. And for this method, no image degradation will occur while using depth. Zoom is primarily used for small structures such as ovaries, the transverse gallbladder, etc. 
but just always be wary of the more you zoom, the less image resolution, and the more blurriness you're going to have from that structure.